walk inside Salem High School right now and it's a mess, but in a good way. As 27 First News anchor Stan Boney tells us there's a renovation underway that'll change the look of the building from the library to the band room. This is the library at Salem High School. Right now you can see it's all torn up. It's under construction. This is the feature piece of the most major renovation to take place here at Salem High School since the early 1970s. You can see behind me the bookcases and the books are all covered with plastic. Uh, it is under construction here. It is eventually going to be what's going to be called a learning commons. There will be comfortable seating in here and places for students to sit around and, and study and to create a, a nice comfortable atmosphere uh, here at Salem High School. Now this isn't the only thing that's being done here at Salem High School. Also the gym is being repainted. Uh, we saw people in there today putting new paint on the walls and on the ceiling. It's brightened up that gym tremendously. Also, the band room, which is at the far end from where I'm standing now, it too is under construction. All the carpeting that has been removed, and that carpeting dated back to when the school was built in 1959. That has been removed, and new carpeting, and that room itself, the band room, also will be freshened up too. This is all to make Salem High School a better place for learning. In the, uh, the world of uh, open enrollment and, and, and competing for students, uh, we're, we're taking care of our facilities. We're, we're not building new buildings, but we're, we're polishing what we have. And this is one of the projects uh, that we have on, on Slate. It's just one of, of, of a few that we have going right now. Now between the library or what will be called the Learning Commons and the band room, the cost of all that, about $250,000. That does not include the painting for the gym. They do expect to have all this done in time for school to begin in August. In Salem, Stan Boney, WKBN 27 First News.